Greetings, Brave Leaders. I hope you're having a fabulous Wednesday. I'm wondering today if you would like to be a woman of influence. And if you are, I'm wondering if you've read this book. And if you haven't, I highly recommend it. You may recognize one of the faces right here, our best friend, Mary Kay Ash. We do owe her a great debt of gratitude. Um, and I'm, I wanted to share with you my experience this weekend. I had the privilege of attending the fall advance in Wakefield, Massachusetts with several national areas, Betty Gilpatrick's being one of them. And there were 10 new sales directors that were not directors at last year's fall advance. Seven of the 10 of them were immigrants from mostly Eastern Bloc, like Uzbekistan and places like that, Poland, Ukraine. Uh, and some of them needed um, translators. They couldn't even speak English, and yet they're sales directors in Mary Kay, and they're educated women with wonderful jobs, anchor women and uh, you know, finance directors and things like that in their countries where they left that country and came to the U.S. to make a better life for themselves. They didn't just get on welfare. They worked. And they did jobs like cleaning ladies and waitressing and, and that kind of thing, retail sales. And then they met Mary Kay. And their lives changed. And they were able to have their families join them here. And it's an amazing story when you think about it, but it's exactly why Mary Kay created our, our company. Is not, yes, enriching women's lives is what we say, and we kind of gloss over it. We're kind of numb to that phrase. But really, Mary Kay started Mary Kay in order to help women gain financial independence. And in fact, she talks about that in this book. That was the real purpose. We've glossed it over by saying enriching women's lives because yes, we know the intangibles that Mary Kay offers, but let's get real. You can make a living. You can raise a family on this business. One of the women that I met has been in Mary Kay a year and a half. She has four offspring sales directors. She's driving a pink Cadillac in less than two years. One girl, she's not even an immigrant, she happens to be a friend of mine, she completed car and DIQ in five weeks. She's only been in Mary Kay since the spring. So why are we not taking this opportunity? We are here in the U.S. with this wonderful opportunity. We are sitting on gold mines and women are crossing the ocean to come here and live in conditions and do jobs that we would never dream of doing in order to create a better life for their families. And then thankfully, they, they stumbled upon Mary Kay. So I just want you to think about two things. One is, are we not grateful that we live here in this wonderful country that offers us so much opportunity? And two is, are you taking advantage of the opportunity that Mary, Mary Kay worked so hard to provide for us? So please think about that as you go through your day and as you consider what your business means to you. And if you would like to increase your business, if you would like to take stronger advantage of the business opportunity that you are sitting on top of, I would be more than happy to support you in that. So please, please, please call me, text me, email me. I would love to work with you to help you reach your dreams. And as Betty would say, what are you waiting for? Have an awesome week.